Hey guys, it's me, Julie, back with another video. It is a purse sale. Yay! I'm going to tell you what we're going to be looking at in a minute. It's going to be so fun. But first, let's do this. If you'd like to purchase anything, you can pause the video here. I will tell you exactly what you need to do. If you paid your invoice already, the postage is on, and they'll probably be going down to the post office tomorrow. So there you go. So thank you. Um... Let's see, what did I want to tell you? Oh, I know. So, you know how Hubs got the snowmobile? I told you. Well, he needs a lot of gear, okay? Because we sold all of his gear when he stopped snowmobiling. And it's probably not what he would need now anyway, because he's riding a different kind of riding. So anyway, he needs a lot of gear. It's gonna cost me a lot of money, us a lot of money. So what I did is I went through my cross body closet um, which is ridiculous. There were way too many. And I pulled out a bunch of bags from there, stuff I had in there. Um, and I'm going to sell those. So it will help me get Jeff's, uh, snowmobile gear. <laughs> so that's what we're going to do. There is, it's a little Kate Spade heavy, you know me, you know, I know. Kate Spade, my, Kate Spade's my girl. So it's a little heavy in Kate Spade, but you know, we'll be all right. And there might be a couple in there that I took from videos and you guys have seen them, but I wasn't positive. So I'm going to show them again. Um, my apologies if it was something you saw many times. Okay. I don't think, I don't, whatever. I don't know. That's the thing. <laughs> All right, you guys, I thought I saw glitter on this. Am I seeing glitter? There is like silver. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is a Kate Spade, you guys. It is this awesome um, black and like an off-white uh, spade detail. Uh, silver tone hardware. The strap and trim is um, neon yellow. It is fantastic. Uh, it has a hitching post type adjustment. Um, I don't know if this is Curvy Girl approved. My guess is probably yes, because... Yes, Curvy Girl approved crossbody. I forgot to check that uh, when I was setting up. Sorry about that. Uh, so there it is. This is a polyurethane bag. Uh, super, super cute. Um, maybe on the crossbodies, I'll give you sizes so you guys know. This one is a nine inch, um, nine inch bag across the bottom. Zip top closure. Let me unstuff. Nate's wife helped Mackenzie. I should just call her Mackenzie, not Nate's wife. Mackenzie, oh, you guys, here, you might win a raffle. <laughs> I don't know what that's from. Um, helped me set up for my purse sale. It was so nice. So inside, there is the um, tag, but there is not a uh, price on it. It says Holly Spade Clover Geo Yellow Multi. Extra large dome crossbody. Okay, and your care card. Put those back in the pocket here it is on the interior it's a black interior it's in really nice condition uh there's a slip pocket on this side and kate spade and neon it's fantastic um let's go back to that strap that i was like is that glitter on there where was that where was it now i'm not gonna be able to find it Okay, so maybe it wasn't there. So along this part of the strap in one spot, it looks like a little bit like glittery. I'm not seeing it. Um, and I do see a little spot right here on the strap. All right, so this one, this one, uh, this was going for between $100 and $230 online. So this one is going to be $70, okay, $70. Okay, come here. Put you over here. I'm trying not to make too big of a mess so I can film easily tomorrow. <laughs> All right, I have another Kate Spade right in a row. This one is the cutest little bag, you guys. I took this to a wedding with me. So, so cute. So it is a br blush, like pink, barely pink, like beigey pink, blush pink. <laughs> It's a flesh toad for some of us. It's a nude. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, it's that color. Um, it is like a patent leather and then um, black leather trim on it. It is the cutest little bag. I think it's leather. I think it is, you guys. 
Uh, it has this little black bow on it. It is the cutest little bag. Gold tone hardware, adjustable strap. This is Curvy Girl approved. Uh, is that a mark? Um, I'm not sure. That might be one little itty bitty mark. Oh, you can't even see. There it is. Tiny, tiny. Okay, so it's a magnetic snap closure. Here's the interior. It's a beige color. Let me unstuff. Come on. And here's the interior. Okay, it is perfect in there. And there is a slip pocket right here. Do I have any tags in here? No, no tags. I keep them in there if I have them typically. This is called the Chelsea Park bag, okay? Um, and I am gonna ask just 35, okay? $35. They weren't going for as much as I was thinking online, so I kept my price lower than what you could get it out there. Give you a little discount for watching my video. Okay, next. I have some Halloween bags today, you guys. I think four, maybe five. And Halloween is definitely out there right now. <laughs> I was in Michael's today and Home Goods, and it was just Halloween City. Uh, this is just a bag from Timu, you guys. Um, it is a pebbled polyurethane. It has this flap with the skull fa um, skull on it. Uh, it has some studding and grommets. Here's the strap. Um, it I never carried it. I grabbed it from Timu last year. It's a snap closure inside it's just one pocket okay <laughs> I think it's super cute and super fun I thought it would be fun for um for Halloween time so there it is uh this one's gonna be um 15 okay 15 dollars I believe that's what I paid on the Timu bags I didn't really mark them up or anything um I was just trying to remember what I paid for them okay next What's next? Okay, I have a Bokkier bag. I believe I got this one originally from Kristen D at Another Chance Resale. Um, I have a couple bags from her in here because I shopped, you know? I like her videos, I shopped them. <laughs> so this is Bokkier, it's a pebbled red leather. Bokkier has beautiful leather. If you haven't heard of the brand, that's what they're known for. And they like hardware. So this is really cool, guys. It's like this toggle closure. It's in this like light gold tone. Um, and let me just show you the bag first. I took this junking once. It was great. She did a great job. You have an adjustable and removable strap. This is Curvy Girl approved. Uh, so this is how you open it. You undo the toggle and look at this interior. <laughs> Isn't that so fun? It's like metallic bronze. The bag is divided into two sections. You have this back one, and then this front one where you have a spot you could put like your ID. Okay, super, super, super cute bag. It looks like, yeah, and these are removable. I'm not gonna say what I was gonna say because it doesn't make sense. <laughs> All right, buck yay. I would say the only thing going on with this, guys, is there's a tiny bit of wear on this toggle from going in and out. Okay, this one is going to be 45, okay, 45. Next. Okay, are you ready for this one? Uh, it's my birthday soon. Oh, Plato's Closet is telling me happy birthday. Thank you. All right, Kate Spade camera bag, you guys. This is a <coughs> black, smooth polyurethane bag. It has gold tone hardware. Sorry, guys. Um, I believe that this is vintage. I'm not totally sure of that. Um, online, they are going for between two and $350. 200 to 350. It is adjustable. Um, I believe this was Curvy Girl approved. Let me just double check. I feel like it might have been a little on the shorter side. No, it goes where it's supposed to, I think. It hits my hip sitting down, so I think it's okay. Isn't it so cute? So it has all this um, camera detail and gold. Um, the hardware is not even really scratched. 
I don't even know if I carried this, if you want to know the truth. I think I must have because um, this is adjusted for me. That would probably be the only thing I see, which are just, they're just little um, marks from storage, right? Something that was probably pressing into it. Okay, magnetic snap closure. And let me unstuff. There you go. I see the care card is still in here and it's a black lining. It's so cute. Oh, I've been forgetting to tell you sizes, you guys, sorry. This one is like a six inch wide. If you need a size on anything, just let me know. Okay, so two to $350 online. I am going to ask just $150. Okay, come over here, friends. Let's see what I have next. Okay, I think the next two came from Kristen D, another chance resale. Um, yeah, and then I think one more, but from a really long time ago. Okay, this one is so cute. Wait till you see. It is a Betsy Johnson, and it looks like a leather jacket. Isn't it so cool? It is blue metallic. It is a uh, faux leather. There's a little mark right there that you can see at some angles, okay? Super cute. This doesn't work or anything, but you can slip something in this pocket. It's just for decoration. Um, it's really fun. You have like these Rivoli studs on it. It is silver tone hardware, removable strap if you'd like to. Definitely curvy girl approved. Thank you, Betsy. Thanks for remembering us. Okay, so zipper closure has this awesome, uh, uh, what's this called? Strap on it. Could you get your hand in here? Almost, but you could put your hand in it like that and have it like a clutch. Okay, zip top closure. These one, this one, there was only one online. And it was $125. Uh, there's a zipper pocket here and a few slips here, a larger one, and then this one's broken down for cards. And there it is, it's nice in there. Okay, so this one, like I said, I saw the only one on there I saw for $125. I would feel weird charging that for a Betsy. So I am only asking, are you ready? Dun, 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 dun. 48 bucks, okay, $48. All right, next. Yeah, this one definitely came from Kristen. Um, yeah, I had another bag with the same print on it. I like loved it, um, like a larger size bag. It is DKNY a graffiti bag. Isn't that so cool? So um, like I said, it's DKNY. You can see it right there. And this is called their graffiti print. So cute. Uh, this one is like four and a half inches wide. Silver tone hardware. You have the DKNY hanging off of here. You have um, an adjustable strap. Uh, this is polyurethane, you guys, not leather. Um, this is a magnetic snap closure. And here's the interior. There is a slip pocket right there. Super, super clean in there. Um, I never carried this one, and it looks like... It really hasn't been carried. It's in really nice shape. I just wanted to look there with you. Okay, so this one is going to be just $28. All righty, next I have another Kate Spade. How many more Kate Spades do we have? One, two, three. Only three more. <laughs> Only, only three more. Okay, so this is a Kate Spade. It is so cute, you guys. It's a Saffiano polyurethane. Um, it is so cute. It is like a um, coral color. It has a stripe. It is in awesome condition, I think, if I'm remembering correctly. Oh, minus this little spot right here. Uh, curb chain, gold tone. And you have your strap right here. Is this Kirby Girl approved? I think it is. Let me just double check. It's a little bit short on this one, but it still is hitting me like at my natural waist. 
Um, so this is a, so let me show you this first. A little bit of the gold is missing on the S, so you see that. Uh, mag I'm sorry, not magnet. It is a snap closure. Here is how the strap attaches with hitching posts. So um, this, I believe, was convertible. You could put different straps with different bags, but you could also take it off and carry this like a clutch or use it as like a pouch in your wallet, in your a wallet, in your purse. Okay, beige interior. I see one little spot right there. Can you see it? One little spot. And then you have your card slots there. This bag was going for 70 to 165 online. And I am going to ask 55. Okay, $55. Okay, I have another Timu skeleton like bag. This one's like a skeleton y tote. I think it got dog glittered. Let's see. Yeah, we got a little bit of linties going on. I'm going to have to lint roll this for you. Okay, here it is. Isn't it so cute? It's like a tote style bag. It's canvas with screen printing on it. Um, this might glow. It has that look like it would. Um, let's see. So canvas uh, at the top handles um, are still wrapped. They're polyurethane. This was never carried. Uh, there is the lint that I need to lint roll. I have a lint roller right in here too. Here's the back with a zipper pocket. Uh, this is in like new condition because it is new. There's the bottom. Uh, this has a zip top closure. Let me unstuff and I do have the strap for it. It is still in its factory elastic. Okay. Silver tone hardware on this one. There's the interior. You have a few, uh, how many? A couple slips over here and a pen slip and then a zip on this side. Super, super cute, you guys. Halloween is around the corner. This one is going to be 18, okay? $18. We got a lint roll. I will try my hardest to remember that. Okay, I've got to go grab bags, guys. Here we go. This is a Michael Kors. Look at how cute it is. <laughs> it is also a blush pink color. Can you tell me? I, can you see I was into like blush pink? <laughs> I still am. I really like it. Uh, this one is a canvas with a polyurethane trim. Gold tone hardware. This one is in like new condition. You have the... Um, belting strap with Michael Kors written on it. I'm going to come down just a teeny bit. Okay. Uh, it is adjustable gold tone hardware. There's not even scratching on this hardware. I don't think I never carried it and I don't think anybody else ever did. Here's the back. There's a little slip pocket here. There's the corners and the bottom. And here's the interior. So you have a magnetic snap closure. There's still the stuffing behind the, the snap part. And you have your care card. Um, oh, I may have shown this before, you guys. Uh, hmm, okay. This is called the Briley Small, okay? Uh, there's a slip pocket there and a slip pocket on this side. It's a tan interior. So Briley Small, it looks like back when I showed this, which I don't know when it was, and I might have not shown it. I might have just decided to keep it. I think that's what I did. Um, okay, so uh, online I saw the cheapest I saw was $89. So this one is going to be $60. Oh, look at Isn't this funny? Oh, we found it online today. $90 to $200. And look, I put $60. <laughs> isn't that funny? Okay, so $60. I guess my pricing is consistent. <laughs> um, I forgot we looked that one up. Sorry, guys. Okay, this is Rebecca Minkoff, and it is one of her amazing straps with all the grommets. Oh, my gosh. Could you please stay up? It is like a clay color or sandstone color. Uh, it is a pebbled leather, and then you have brass hardware. You have this awesome brass metal ring. You have this amazing grommet strap. I bought this just for the strap. You know me. Uh, it is removable. 
um, that comes off right here. Look at this cool thing that it hooks to. I don't know, I thought it was kind of fun. Okay, so this does have a few little things. There's a mark there. I think I bought this for myself on ThreadUp. Um, and sometimes it's hard to see, you know what I mean? They're like, good condition. Well, you know, this is good condition, but I can't see what the marks are, right? So there's a little spot right there. Uh, there's a big pocket on the back. This is a magnetic snap closure. There's fuzz on it. Let me get that off. There we go. Um, here's the interior. This is a gusseted, oh, there's like tissue in there. Sorry. A gusseted um, slip pocket, maybe a cell phone pocket, and a zip pocket right here. Let's make sure that one works. Yep. And then this section also has a zipper. You could keep something separate in it. Really cool. Cute little bag. Uh, <clears throat> I have to take a drink. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> okay. Sorry about that. This one is going to be 40. Okay. Four zero. Next. this over here okay this one is so cute you might have seen it this may have been in a thread up box I don't remember it is the most beautiful color you guys it is a gray with like a lilac color it is coach it's the monogram canvas it is so pretty I think it reminds me of the walls in here um which, guys, I think I'm painting the walls coral. I think I'm going to be crazy and do it. Um, there are marks on the back. One, two, three, and a teeny one. Okay, just so you know. The back has a zipper pocket. Um, you have this strap, which is adjustable on the sides here. Um, and you have your coach tag here. Uh, this is leather trim. Okay, silver tone hardware. There's a mark right here on the leather. Okay probably it was in that spot at some point and it's a mark from the buckle super super cute bag let's look at the corners okay so there's a mark on the bottom here and here and here okay so just be aware um corners are not bad kind of like a dumpling bottom give you a little bit more room okay super super sweet i love this bag um let's see the only other thing, this no, it's just from hanging. Somebody had it hung up that way. All right, let me undo it. It is a zipper closure on the top. Oh, Lordy. Yes, this was in a thread up bag, I remember now. Look at the bottom, thread up box, I mean. The bottom is wrecked. I forgot about that. Do you see it all? lots of staining okay it does pull out so you could probably wash it i did not do that obviously slip pockets there and a zip pocket here okay so she's not perfect she's got some things going on she is just going to be 30 dollars. okay 30 dollars. i have to write this down because i gave you guys a coupon because i had her too high okay put that over there Next, I have the bag that I literally just stopped carrying last week. I carried it all summer. It is so fun, you guys. Carl Lagerfield, and I don't know if it's called the candy bag, but it should be. <laughs> it is so cool. Uh, this is a pebbled polyurethane. Um, you have the amazing guitar strap. Um, it is removable. You could carry it just with the top handle. I'm the only one who ever carried it. It was new when I got it. Um, fuzz, sorry. I did notice a couple of these little candies. Uh, did get a little scratch. See that? You're going to see some. Okay, they stick out from the bag. And no matter how careful you are, Sometimes it happens. You have to be really close to see it, but I like you guys to know everything. Okay? You can see them. It's hard to see, huh? See that scratch right there? That's what I'm talking about. Okay, so it has the red top handle. 
Uh, the pink color blocking around the sides and bottom. Corners are still perfect. Here is the back of the bag. A big pocket back here. Something's in here. <laughs> Michael's magnetic paint, Fabri-Tac. I told you, I just stopped carrying this. <laughs> All right, so it is one of the flap tops. This is definitely Curvy Girl approved, by the way. And it is adjustable on the strap. And in here, um, it says, elegance is an attitude, Carl Lagerfeld. Okay, so you have a slip pocket here with some card slots in front of it, and then a big slip on this side, okay? Alrighty, here she is. This one I saw for 85 to 160 online. I'm gonna ask $65, okay? $65. Alrighty, next. I thought this was a fossil bag, you guys. We're gonna have to look a little bit more carefully. Um, I did not do that before I started the video. I meant to. Uh, I really thought it was a fossil, but I'm not seeing a fossil marking on it. This one is not perfect, okay? I just fell in love with all this hardware and I said I don't care that it's not perfect. So just know it's not perfect. It is um, brass tone hardware. You have all these zippers and these amazing little uh, zipper pulls. Yeah, the, this is leather by the way. It's like a coral color, um, pebbled leather, um, a removable adjustable strap. Okay, uh, it has leather on one side, belting on the other and you can see it's just a little bit dingy. Okay, the top is there's nothing wrong with it, but you can see that it's been loved. See, it's like, it's like pilly. <laughs> so that's super fun. Now watch this. Dun, dun, this side's fun too. It is a patchwork um, extravaganza. <laughs> uh, zipper pocket here. Um, I see a thread hanging. Um, anything else I need to tell you? I would say just overall a little bit dingy, but not horrible. There's the bottom, like there's no really marks on the bottom except right here. It's kind of a corner mark, okay, and here. Okay, so the other thing about this guy is it is a zipper top closure or you can pull this drawstring in, okay? So you could do either one. The end of the drawstring has tassels, Okay, so let's unzip. Unzip and unstuff. Yeah, I don't know guys, maybe it's not a fossil. I, when I bought it, it said it was fossil, like it even says it on this paperwork. Um, but inside it says Amera leather. There's the interior. Okay, a couple stains in the bottom. Let's see what we're seeing. Yep, right there, see the pink? And you have slip pockets here and a zipper center um, section. Actually, it's kind of like, um, not a section, but it's a big zipper pocket with a slip behind it and another zipper behind it, okay? All right, so. I guess this is not fossil, it's a Mara leather. I don't know why they said it was a fossil. Is that fossil, um, is that fossil's brand? I don't think so. I'm not sure you guys, that's how it's written. Okay, this one's gonna be just 30 bucks. 30 bucks, I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Uh, um, okay, next, we have this Marc Jacobs. This was a Kristen D bag, you guys, so, so, so long ago. Maybe three, three and a half, four years ago. I don't know, it was a long time ago. This is a polyurethane, it's like a faux, um patent leather and it's faux ostrich okay so it has all the little dots that looks like ostrich print even on the strap which is a black strap it has gold tone hardware um 
I believe this is a vintage bag. Uh, it has this awesome pink um, name plaque. Isn't that cool? And um, let's see, what else do we need to know? I see a few threads hanging that I missed, but I think that's probably all. Oh, I see a mark right there. Okay. Uh, oh no! You guys, look at this. I never knew this. Look at that, it's sliced. Somebody's glued it. Oh my gosh, I bet Kristen D never even saw that too. Maybe this came out of thread up when I was watching her. It might have. Okay, um, magnetic snap closure. And let me unstuff. It's cool that this is like a dumpling shape that I like to say, you guys. Um, it is an amazing pink interior. You guys, by the way, I don't care that if Kristen D missed that, by the way, it happens. We're doing the best we can. <laughs> it is like a fuchsia interior. It's nice and clean in there. Slip pockets, a zip pocket over here. Um, and then you also have, you can unzip the flap. And that pocket goes all the way to the bottom of the bag. Okay. So I never carried this bag. <laughs> I like loved it and I never wanted to get rid of it even though I wasn't carrying it. I'm like, no, I love it, I want it. So I probably would have seen that if I had. Um, so let's look at it again. I definitely think somebody glued this. Maybe somebody sliced it with a knife getting it out of a box. Um, I bet that's probably what happened, but it's been glued um, and it's not going anywhere, okay? And obviously it's not easy to find it. <laughs> All right, so if this was in perfect condition, they were going for 130 to 170 online. I originally was gonna ask 65, but I am going to drop down to 30 bucks, okay? 30 bucks, because it has a boo-boo. It is still very cute, though. I had to mark my paper, because I gave you a coupon. <laughs> a coupon. Okay, you guys, wait till you see this one. I don't know if you remember or not, but I showed you this last Halloween. I bought it. I never carried it, and I am going to sell it. It is a Betsy Johnson Halloween bag, and it goes from, um, I'm trying to show you well, the skull to Betsy. <laughs> skull to Betsy. <laughs> it has this cool frame. This is a faux patent leather, you guys bronze uh, tone hardware. This is really cute. It's a web and a heart shape. Um, again, it was never carried, so it's in perfect condition. Uh, here's your strap, not adjustable, but it is Curvy Girl approved. Um, the top is a zipper. And it is very stuffed. This is probably all the factory stuffing we're gonna take out here. Oh yeah, she's stuffed. No, maybe not factory, I might have done it because it's two different colors. Holy heck, come on. That was a lot of stuffing in there. Okay, so here is the tag. I kept it in the bag like I told you I try to do. 128, I think I paid $100 for it, but I cannot remember to save my life. The interior is this pretty pink color, super cute. Um, cute little structured bag for Halloween. So cute, you guys. Okay, she's not gonna stay up. <laughs> All right, so the Betsy Johnson skull bag is going to be $90. I will ask 90 for this Betsy. <laughs> I just said that was too high for Betsy, but not for that one. It's special, and I found one online that was like $120. Okay, I have this Kate Spade. It is a pebbled polyurethane. Uh, it is a black and white spade print um, with the stripes. I think it is so cute. So, so cute. Um, adjustable strap. Um, this kind of looks looks like a little dingy. I just want you to see that. I don't know if it was always like that. It may have been, but I want to show you. Okay, so on the front, we have this big pocket. On the back, it is just plain. 
on the bottom. Yeah, it is a little dingy. So this part is dingy right here, okay? And then there's some staining on the bottom. The corners are still fine. Just some uh, discoloration. Oh, hold on, actually. Little tiny wear on that corner. I fibbed. And a little wear on that corner. Yep, corners have wear. Wear on that corner. And not this one. Okay, super pretty graphic print. I think it's so pretty, you guys. Uh, let me unstuff. Here's the interior. It is amazing fuchsia pink in there. A couple slips and a zip over here. Let me check that zipper pocket. I didn't check it. Yep. Okay, this one is going to be... Hmm. I think I'm giving you a coupon. I'm giving you a coupon. It's a corner coupon. Uh, let's go... Let's go 40 on that one. Okay, $40. Corner coupon. Uh, next, I pulled this one out of a thread up box with you guys. So we opened a name brand handbag box and one of you loved it and wanted it. So I hope you're watching. <laughs> um, so this is a pebbled polyurethane. It is monogrammed in the um, brown and deep, deep chocolate, chocolate brown. The trim is orange. This is from somebody had it had held a little bit of hung up by this. Just so you see, it has a little bit of a bend in it. Um, cute bag, you guys. So front pocket. This is like the same shape as that last Kate Spade. Uh, front pocket here. Here's the back side. There are some scuffs right here. And the corners have some wear. Not horrendous. I kept this for myself right in the video. I was like, I'm gonna keep that, mm-hmm. <laughs> Gold tone hardware on this one, you guys. It's a zipper closure. Um, let me empty this out. Looks like there's probably a little wear on that corner. Oh, guys, I fibbed. It was America's Thrift Supply, and I have um, a certificate of authentication. authenticity. There we go. Uh, here's the interior. There is something on here. Okay, like nail polish or something. There it is. Uh, zipper pocket here and some slips and a pen slip there. They're a little dingy on the top from people putting their hands in and out. And then I think that the gold tone's a little wear worn on that. Oh, maybe not. The lights. The lights were tricking me. It's fine. Okay, so this little coachy uh, is going to be 40 Okay, $40 on the coach. Next, we have a B. Mikowski. I believe you guys saw this recently. So forgive me uh, for showing you again. It is leather. It is a really soft leather, almost a suede. Maybe it is a suede. Um, so it has this uh, gray part here and then snake print here. Silver tone hardware, there's a scratch on there. This is a magnetic snap pocket here. These drawstrings are just for decoration. It's super, super cute. It has the traditional B. Mikowski pocket here. Everything's nice on this one. And the strap is, um, oh yeah, this is a strap I think that you can, yeah, you can wear this as um, a crossbody or you can shorten the strap by putting it back through this one, okay? Uh, magnet closure. Here's the interior. It's in nice shape. And on this side you have a zipper, a couple slips, and a spot to clip your keys, okay? Super cute. This one is going to be just $30. I have no idea what I asked for it the first time. <laughs> 30 bucks. <sighs> okay, next. Um, I have to get the bags near me. Be right back. Okay. We have like six bags left, you guys. And depending on what time it is, I have no idea. Oh, we're okay. I do have an America's Thrift Supply box that we could open together. So let's do that. 
True Religion. Isn't it cute? So True Religion, Jean Brand. Um, I almost said that. I almost said it was uh, it's a uh, Chloe Kardashian's line. That is not true, Julie. <laughs> That's good American. Okay. Anyway, this is new, you guys. Um, it has a little pocket on the front here. It is made of jeans, jean material, denim. Okay. It is in like new condition. Um, these are polyurethane and they are still wrapped. It has this super wide beige guitar strap that is removable and adjustable. Um, this is the factory stuffing in here. And it looks like we have a silica pack in there still. And we have the tag. Okay, so this one, let me put this back together here so she'll stand up so you can see her. Here's where the um, strap attaches. And it looks like it also has a magnetic snap closure to hold it shut. Okay, so this one is going to be 32 Okay, $32. Okay, what is next? The cutest bag, guys. Are you ready? I'm a little sad about this one. Look at it. Isn't it so cute? It's so, so cute, you guys. So cute. Um, This is Kate Spade. Is this leather? I think this is a leather bag, you guys. Pretty sure. So Kate Spade, it is like a charcoal gray pebbled leather, removable and adjustable strap. It has this scalloped edge with gold tone grommets. Ah, oh, it's so cute. All right, here we go, up close. Isn't it so sweet? I love this bag. It's just so darn cute. It's in nice shape. Um, the just strap is curvy girl approved and it is adjustable. Here's your top handle. It's in nice shape. Let me unstuff. We just put a little bit of stuff in, in this one. Striped interior. There's two sections, a big slip there. And on this side, a zip. And look, even this has fun, chunky hardware. Isn't that so fun? It's so fun. Okay. So this one, the Kate Spade, the charcoal Kate Spade is going to be 48 okay $48 cutest bag ever okay I'm pretty sure uh oh I just lost my papers thank you <laughs> okay this I'm pretty sure I got from um Kristen D kind of recently well not super recent but um it is Zara it is a um smooth polyurethane with silver tone studs it is the cutest little shape Almost like a little saddle shape. Isn't it cute? Um, I didn't check if this was Curvy Girl approved. I actually never carried it. It's a short one, you guys. So this would be a shoulder bag or a crossbody on a smaller person. Has these amazing little tassel details. Um, let's look at it more. I don't believe there was anything going on with this one. Probably not. Kristen D's bags are always perfect. If for some reason you're not watching her, make sure you are for purses on Fridays at 5 p.m. Eastern. Always good stuff. Here's the interior. It's like a raw interior and it has a magnetic snap closure, fold over kind of closure like that. Okay, so this one by Zara is going to be 28, 28 bucks, that's it. All right, this bag, you guys, oh my gosh. Um, it is, I bought this bag on eBay before I really got into bags, but I just loved it. It was so cool to me, this little top handle on here. It is a vintage bag. Um, it's like a brushed nickel kind of hardware. The strap is removable. Um, it does have like bends in it from being hung, okay? So just so you know, uh, this is polyurethane. It's in a beige and then like a chestnut and then a beige kind of color blocked. It's really cool. There are a couple marks on it. I bought it used, um, has these amazing feet. It's, it's such, such a neat little bag, I think. There's a mark here. And then in there, there's a couple. And then there's a mark here. That looks like it will come off. I don't know what that is. 
I think that's going to come off, but there is a mark right there. Sorry, I missed it. Okay, so um, when you open the bag, there are two sections, and there are magnetic snap closures. I don't even know what brand it is. Ivan Cipriani, made in Italy. It is dusty in there. It is also a polyurethane liner. There's a zipper pocket there. And this side, also a magnetic snap. Okay. And I can see, like, under this handle, there's a little bit of wear on the polyurethane, just so you're aware of it. It's a really cute bag, guys. <laughs> I've had it in my closet so long. Okay, this one is going to be $30, okay, $30. I didn't look that up, that Ivan Cipriani. Maybe they've gone up in price, oh boy. Okay, this bag, I think I have shown you guys, my apologies, it is a uh, leather bag, pebble leather. It is in a deep, deep, like red purple color with all this amazing fringe on the front and the back. Uh, you have an adjustable strap. This is Curvy Girl approved. Um, this is the nicest, softest leather, you guys. It is so nice. It's a very deep purple, like a dark wine color almost. Super cute. Oh, it's Lucky Brand. I totally forgot that. <laughs> Lucky Brand. Uh, brass tone hardware. You have tassels on the zipper. Cute little bag. Here's the interior. It's a fabric interior fabric lining, zipper pocket here, and a slip pocket here. So cute, lucky brand. This one's gonna be 30, okay, 30 bucks. All right, all right, two more bags. They are both Halloween, no, one's Halloween, one's not, but they are both from Timu. And then we'll look at that America's Thrift Supply box. Okay, I have this one. It is polyurethane. It is a box bag. It is in a box shape. It is hard sided. Okay. It has this really cool chain. You know, that's why I was drawn to it, right? Uh, you have a zipper pocket out here that I've never tried. Oh boy. Maybe it's just for decoration. Yep. That's just for decoration, guys. <laughs> Don't use that. I almost broke it. <laughs> Shocking. Uh, this has never been carried. Uh, snap closures on the top. And it has its um, strap. Obviously, it's removable. Um, and then it has, oh, that's right. I remember this. Um, if I remember correctly, this carabiner style clip goes here. There we go. Um, and this carabiner goes here. And then this carabiner on this end attaches over here. So the strap has the chain too. So cute, isn't it? Cute little bag. Okay, this one is going to be $18. $18. Okay, one more Timu. This one is a um, Halloween bag too. If this doesn't sell, I'm stealing that black strap. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Polyurethane, pebbled polyurethane in black. This does have a strap for it. You have all the little skeleton pieces there. Um, gold tone hardware. Uh, here we go. This is where the strap attaches. Uh, this is a magnetic snap closure. And you have a pocket here. Okay, and then there's two sections. So let's unzip. One. Two. And it still has this foam in it. It was never carried. You have this section has kind of three sections divided with a zipper in the middle. Uh oh, I think that zipper is broken. Oh, I fixed it. It just needed to get back on the track. Um, let me put this back in here. And then this section has the cutout for the strap. And there's a couple credit card slips there. I like the color of the interior, it's a cool color. Um, let me get this back right. Okay, so this one, I want you to be able to see it when I tell you the price. There we go. Uh, this one's going to be just 15 okay? 
All right, cool. We made it through all of my crossbodies that I was ready to give away now. Well, sell, I should say. Um, I am going to go through my other bags, too. I don't know. Oh, shoot. I forgot to grab one. Hold on, guys. I do have one more, and I'll grab the America's Thrift Supply Box at the same time. I forgot about this one. I was going to sell this one. Okay. I ordered... Oh, my goodness. I just stepped on bubble wrap. <laughs> Did you guys hear that? I'm sorry. It was probably loud. All right. So I have this little German Shepherd one. Um, it is a uh, polyurethane. It's pebbled. It says German Shepherd love. Isn't it so cute? And it is color blocked with black. So cute. I don't think there's anything wrong with it with these spots. I think it's just part of the print. Uh, gold tone hardware. Here's the bottom. There's a mark right there. Here are the handles. Okay, I see a thread. I didn't see that, obviously, because I forgot it over there. Zip top closure. Okay, I do have the strap. It's obviously removable, and it is adjustable. And you have a zipper pocket here and a couple slip pockets on this side. It's like a chocolate brown interior. And this one is going to be, how much did I pay for this? Mm, oh, I just saw this. Look, you've got some peeling polyurethane from rubbing. Yep, here and here. Okay, so that will affect the price, obviously. Let's do 10 bucks. Okay, 10 bucks on that one. Okay, so we did that. Okay, America's Thrift Supply. Dun dun. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Where does America's Thrift Supply come from? Birmingham, Alabama. I didn't know that. Do they always? Is that the only location? I don't know. Let me open it. I did order two of these. I think they put them in the same box, which is kind of crappy because they charged me like they were in separate boxes because you have to order one and then go back and order another one. So kind of weird that they don't put them in their own boxes, right? I mean, I'm all for saving the planet, though. Oh, no, you guys, it's only one. Okay, well, I haven't gotten my other one then. Where is it? It's late. Okay, so what did we buy here? We bought Authentic Designer Purse Mystery Box. So these, this, all the purses from this line, from this part, are, um, have certificates of authenticity. I paid $39.98 with shipping. All right, I'm gonna have to check where my other box is. They come wrapped in plastic like this, and there's our certificate. This is Michael Kors. Michael Kors. Okay, so certificate of authenticity. It shows you exactly what it is and that it is indeed authentic. Um, okay, so it is the monogram canvas and it has brown leather trim. It is a tote style. Um, so the canvas looks okay. I don't know. Usually these bags are a little bit better. I'm kind of disappointed in this bag, if I'm honest. Look at, it's all like dingy right there. Um, yeah, there's a pull right there. Look at seriously yeah not that's not cool um okay so yeah edge coat's gross we got that coming out and then the handles are disgusting look at how dirty they are that is some serious dirt <laughs> uh the handles are adjustable and they go in through these grommets this is i've never had a bag this damaged from this from buying these this style from them uh, I have two slip pockets here it's overall super dirty in here too two slip pockets here and a zip and then there is um this piece here which could cinch it in that snaps <sighs> to cinch it in kind of like that okay this bag is in crap shape I don't even think I can make my money back on this 
Um, you think I should let them know? I don't know. I think it's pretty crappy. Um, I think I, I would be like, okay, it is what it is if it didn't have this sticking out, right? I mean, that's kind of yucky. Okay, so if anybody would like this bag, I'm just going to do 10 bucks. Okay, 10 bucks, and I'm going to probably talk to America's Thrift Supply. Alrighty, guys, so tomorrow is going to be more jewelry. I think I'm going to do clearance again for Clearance Friday, and I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.